So now I'm going to do the steaming mode. The temperature is too high, but I go on the steam. It will automatically preset all the values. So it's again 99 degrees, half an hour, I will start. The commissioner will cool down itself. And uh, I will add my fish when the temperature is, is ready. Or I can cool it manually, cool it down. There is a, on the functions, I will add the function cooling down. Now it recognizes that I want it to cool down, and maybe you can see it's 180, 178, 77. So it is telling me the right, uh, the actual temperature. But if I would put the salmon inside, I would ruin the fish because I want to steam it. So I have to wait maybe one or two minutes, and it's going to let me know when the temperature is ready to, to go. You can uh, do, uh, as I said in the beginning, I was trying to make some, some stock, I'll put it back, but uh, if you make a sausage or stock or demi glaze or jus or anything as a sauce, you can also do it overnight or you can place a big pot inside, close it, 99 degree steam, and you can go home and next morning you come with a reduced nice stock from the bones. and. Uh, it's not nothing what could happen. It's mm -hmm. safe inside. So a lot of people are afraid to leave something overnight. So we already said that it has a different separate memory and battery to remember everything.
we'll do everything together. We're going to do broccoli, carrots, uh, one fish, second fish, and uh, it shouldn't be the aftertaste. So it should be very easy. See, now I reach the temperature from 180, 99. It's telling me load the food, so it, I cool down the temperature. I stop the sound. very important for a restaurant business when they do the steam, not many restaurants are actually doing this, is that we are getting requests almost every day. If they don't believe if they open the door and the steam goes away, they can get a steam immediately. So when I do presentations, I open the door and I close it because that's what they do in our car, open check, see if it is ready or not. And the steam generator, it's so fast that immediately after you close the oven, within a several seconds, the steam is back into the oven. So you can also see the temperature. It's, I opened it from 99, it went to 90, now it's 95, 96. So it's going very fast. And uh, anyways, what we're going to do again is, the, because we want to cook a lot of things together. So I will ask, uh, I will find the function rect rectangle again. And now we'll do the steaming. I will go nine minutes and start. Someone is already there. Nine minutes. But we will put the, uh, into the, next to the salmon, we put some broccoli. So I open the steamer.